All right, guys, we got this. Let's go. Gun wide, trips deep. Pros next, go. On one, on one. Ready? Three. Ready. What's going on, everyone? Incap24 here from Huddle.gg. In today's video, I want to talk about a match beating concept that I've been holding on. Um, a lot of times during the year, I don't like to put things out that um, just kind of exploit bad programming just because I don't want it to be out there. And I want to make sure that the game is as fun for everybody as possible. Um, I know that EA has eyes on this channel, and a lot of times when I put things out there, they're able to go ahead and um, basically patch it. And I want this to be patched for future um you know i doubt it'll be for 22 but for madden 23 getting the match rules and um you know basically all tied up right so this play is called scat and the concept basically is then don't worry about scat what i want you to look at is the b route when you have a bubble route um basically what that does is it kind of messes up with whose player is who because he goes backwards before he goes forwards I'm just going to block my running back, and the only thing I have to do on this play is put the Y on a streak. And then in order to make this work with more room, I'm just going to put the X on a um, out route, okay? So it's going to look like this. I could put this X on, on pretty much anything that's vertical, and it's going to work. And what you're going to see, this is going against cover four palms. No one's going to cover the Y. What happens is they basically read it to where the bubble route gets two defenders and nobody covers the inside player. Um, you know, like I said, this is something that I typically don't want to put out because I don't want this to be something that, you know, gets exposed or whatever the case is. But, you know, we need a better game. We need to get, you know, more awareness on things that need to get fixed. This is one of them, right? Again, all you got to do is put the Y on a streak and um, basically against cover four palms they're basically going to jump the, the b route you can see how we're going to be able to bomb this okay now let's go ahead and um show you against cover six i'll show you against cover six invert all these are going to work so here's cover six and you're going to see here the reason why is that we're attacking the palm side see how there's two deep zones in, in the uh on the left and one quarter flat it's basically attacking palms it's going to have the same rules you're going to see how this is going to work. So somebody's doing cover six, and any time that they're playing auto flip on, um, you're going to be able to get this um, result just because of the fact that it's going to the trip side. Same thing's going to be with cover six invert. Again, you're going to see the left side's the same palm side. All you got to do is take the inside receiver, put him on a streak, uh, make sure that the X just goes you know, to a certain spot, and now you've got that easy catch, right? So you've got that easy bomb play. Now, what we're going to show you here next is that if, this isn't just this play. This is Gun Trio right here out of the Steelers playbook I'm in right now. I'm going to show you here. I'm just going to go to Trips Tight and Flex. It's got the same scat play. It's got the same bubble screen. Um, it's not a screen, but a bubble route. And I'm going to go ahead and call Cover Four Palms again just so you can see it and understand that it's a concept that if you have this route, you're going to be able to make this work, right? So here we go again. Um, this is a different formation, same exact route combination, and you can see how this is going to get open, and you, you see the story, right? Again, want to make sure that we get awareness on this so this gets fixed for the future, because I really want to see match be in a spot that can be viable. A lot of times with match, in my opinion, it's really, really good if you're not playing somebody who knows how to beat it. If you know how to beat it, and at that point, you know, the offense always holds that chalkboard last. They're going to have that ability to basically draw up what they want. And it's going to be tough on your opponent um, when they don't know how to stop it, right? Now, what does stop this is cover four quarters. I want to make sure you understand this because it's a different type of coverage. So this is a cover six, cover six invert palm speeder, right? So here's this, put the wide streak. So you do have something if somebody's running this on you, just call quarters. Quarters will lock this up. You can see that they no longer is going to be open, right? Um, on our website, we show a bunch of quarters uh, beaters. So if this is something that you want to use and want to use some of the stuff to make sure that you have other things to go to, absolutely have it. The other thing is cover nine. Cover nine will stop this as well because the cover six side is on the right side. So if somebody's playing cover nine, which you can kind of tell here because of the way that they're aligned, if you see that they're... Um, the player on the left is at a cover two and the player on the right is at a cover four. I'll show it to you here again. Against cover nine, the Y is going to get you know, basically uh, passed off. 
and he's going to be able to get stopped. If you're facing cover nine, all you got to do is flip the play. And as long as they don't flip with you, you're now attacking the cover um, nine, the, the cover four side. See how the, the cover four palm side is on the right side? And then you can do the same thing, right? So um, it all depends if they're, if they're savvy enough to flip. If they aren't, then this is against cover nine. You can see here that this is going to be an easy touchdown. So the what you want to use this concept again against is cover four palms, cover six, cover six invert. And if you are going against cover nine, you can flip the play. As long as they don't flip, then you're attacking the correct side and you're in good shape. So this is definitely a play in which um, can definitely, you know, obviously exploit the coverage. Um, you know, and uh, if we can get enough eyes on this, then, you know, this can get fixed. And we can be able to get, you know, a little bit better, um, you know, match coverage that, that uh, accounts for people that are staying behind the line like that bubble route. I've shown different, um, you know, uh, concepts with bubbles in, in our website that um, have been, you know, there for all year. This one was kind of one that I've been holding on to and saying, you know what, I'll put it out now because um, it's pretty much towards the end of the competitive season. I just don't want there to be anything that, you know, is really tough. But there is counters to this right the cover four quarters is a counter cover uh, nine as long as you flip with them you can cut, stop this as well so you definitely can use this if you'd like um but definitely a um video that i wanted to make sure that was out there so we can get a better game i appreciate it guys and we'll catch you on tomorrow's video